He's all seat balled it in. kind of it all started you know obviously I played in a number of arenas but um, you could say Brantford and, and Caledonia are the two spots where you know I started you know the kind of that competitive that junior that junior hockey and um, again the list goes on for the amount of people that you know I played with and you know coached me and have been a part of but um, you know obviously a good spot and a big spot to you know bring it this is where I got 62 it's from when they're in Brantford but um, followed here so a uh, lot of history here. Days about me, I guess, in a sense, but it's not even about that. You know, I just wanted to bring it to as many people, obviously, just to kind of see it. You know, a lot of people haven't experienced, you know, just seeing the trophy in person. So, um, again, today is obviously a big day for myself, but um, you know, I just want to share it with as many people as I can. Obviously, we got told two weeks ago when uh, his day was, and he uh, he said that he wanted to make a stop here, which uh, was pretty pretty cool. Like, He's so humble and never never forgot where he came from and started and still stays in touch with all the owners and everything like that. And just uh, everyone in the organization, that's why everyone's here today too, right? It's just, it's so cool for him to bring it back here and him get, all these guys get to see what he's accomplished and he's sharing it with everyone, which is the best part. I'm just so proud of Brandon for uh, working so hard. He set his mind on when he was, uh, when he was developing. I remember him playing in Brantford. And then the year that we came to Caledonia, he he was he skated like a pro right away when he was 16. You knew he was going to go somewhere. Well, Brandon was a kid that was overlooked when he was 16 years old. Uh, a lot of doors were shut on him, but he got a new avenue to hockey by playing here in Brantford and Caledonia. And just to see the the work and the hard commitment that he put into the game, um, just transpired to success. It just speaks volumes about not only him as an individual and his work ethic, but the organization itself and how they want to propel, propel players to that next level, but also the league, right? Um, he doesn't get there without playing against hard competition and other top end players. So uh, I just think it, you know, his success today, um, it just touches on everything that's been involved from on that pathway.